Welcome to Farm Hand Vlogs YouTube channel where I try to film everything from getting the land ready to getting seeds in the ground and keeping the seed going throughout summer, keeping it clean and then also harvesting and then getting back into getting the land ready. I hope uh, in a, few, a year or so or not so long to start my own farming and then bring y'all along on that process as well. So that'll be exciting what the future holds. I don't know what. Uh, how, when or how exactly but that is a plan so thanks for joining me today i'll be land breaking also known as plowing so welcome to the channel I think it'd be definitely nice to maybe clean some dirt out. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. So I'm running here with a uh, 8320R tractor, IVT uh, transmission with an ILS pretty nice tractor so far anyway. I've been ha had two days today it's not sure why but it was actually a very good week came over here and it worked right away but I haven't, I haven't been getting signal right there uh, last couple of days I had to warm up the tractor and then turn it off all sorts of nonsense felt like to me anyway not a bunch of nonsense but it worked and so and then I've from right there all to that pivot over there that's half from that field. I've already started another field. So these both of these fields are 100 acres. These are a little bit smaller than our normal. As I've mentioned before, that not all of them are uh, 120 acres. But yeah, this one is 100 acres. And right now I have got 14 so far. I started yesterday evening, went kind of late, and then today got going today again. So. It's actually pretty nice. Today it's working very good. Uh, very good. A lot better than that uh, first circle that I did. As you can see, it's not really uh, a ditch. It's all very even. That's what I like. That's what I really want to do. That way, everything. Since we do have stalks that are going this direction, and I am plowing exact opposite, it wants to drag every now and then. But overall it's not that bad since we did disc uh, right there so these are not uh, just we shredded this and then we disced it as I mentioned in my last video what we were doing and so as yeah, so we did that and so with the disc it made it kind of soft but it seems like this feel works still pretty good we're not doing it too deep and so we're doing a phenomenal job so far. Yeah, right there, uphill, uh, right there, it's kind of crooked, but that'll work. And then right there, I got another hill. As you can see, it looks like it's, uh, right there's the end. And then it goes down, and then it's way further yet. But yeah, I think we have had a very successful day so far. I've been able to probably, since now it's too bright, 44, and I had nine when I got here this morning, so. I think I'm gonna try to get all the way to the middle, so tomorrow when I come back, I can just uh, walk the pivot, and then uh, once I got the tractor running warm, I can get started with plow plowing again. So that'd be pretty nice. I'm gonna try if I don't have problems. We'll see what we can do. But not a whole lot going on. It's just very nice on this end. On the other end, uh, it's very sandy. And then it doesn't want to pull as great as it does over here. But no, so far it's been very nice. Oh yeah, that turned out really nice. So yeah, another day has come to an end. So we will see you guys in the morning.
everybody. Thanks for sticking around for day two. Not a whole lot going on, still no difference. I figured I wouldn't end the video just in case something might happen. I was gonna include it in this video about plowing. They worked very nice coming. I came here this morning at nine, turned the tractor on, I greased everything, plow tractor over everything and turn. It worked perfectly fine with my green GPS again. So I've been going constantly since then and just up and down, up and down, up and down all day. So it's not not been doing a whole lot. So yeah. What do y'all guys want to see? So since I've been doing this for quite a bit, let me know what you're interested in farming, peanut farming, kind of your questions or what you want to see. Oh, and uh, you want to stick around. I, we got, I got some good news today. I'll just say one of them, we did get a new tractor and there's more. So uh, we've got some exciting stuff coming in the near future. And so that's always nice. And just so getting more and more stuff growing I'm liking it, making farm life easier, so. So what we're trying to do here is, as you can see, the dust is blowing like crazy. And I've given it a few tries. It's not working too fabulous, but it is getting it a little bit of a different color, so that's good. Yeah, I got it completely down, or I floated, and it doesn't go in the ground much more, so. That's not good. We're gonna do it anyway. So, as it, yeah, look, look at that, and then look at that right there. It is darker. So, hopefully, it holds it up for a few more days or a little bit longer with our wind. And then, because it's too dry to sow wheat everywhere here, and we haven't had enough rain. We actually had a little bit of a drizzle or a little bit uh, this morning before I got here. Can't really too closely see it but yeah it's still dry dust is blowing we got 30 miles an hour of wind today so we're doing I guess all the effort we can to cover it up a little bit 